This is my gyro stabilized two axis camera gimbal. For more info and tech specs on it, click on the link right here. This will take you to a previous video. I mounted it to the end of a long piece of wood to act as a handheld camera crane and eliminate the need for a tripod to mount the crane onto. Here's some video from the crane. As you can see, there's still a lot of shake in the video. Although there's really no slop in the gearing, I think this shake just comes from the nature of the frame and the stick it's mounted to. And the gyros aren't sensitive and the motors aren't fast enough to confiscate for it. Now here's some video from this gimbal on the back of a car. You get just about the same results. Using image stabilization software will make it a little smoother, but it's still not perfect. You'd be better off to use a glide cam or something like that. I have tried using geared motors as servos, but they are too fast and just shake back and forth. The future of gyroscopically stabilized camera gimbals lies in stepper motors. A stepper motor is similar to a brushless motor, but it's controlled by different frequencies of electric pulses to move much more precisely. These motors can be used to direct drive, eliminating the need for gearing. This makes the gimbal much smoother and faster. Currently, the biggest problem with these motors is that they are difficult to control. They have to be controlled by a special controller with microprocessors similar to an ESC. Someone needs to invent a circuit board that converts a servo signal into stepper motor commands. I'm no expert, but I believe this would revolutionize do-it-yourself camera gimbal. As of right now, there's only one small camera gimbal that uses direct drive stepper motors, and it's quite pricey. I accept donations. Thanks for watching. Bye.